Hi, my name is James. I'm with LED Torch Shop Australia and today we're doing a review on two of the Nightcore flashlights. Today we've got the EX11, which is this guy here, the shorter one, and we've also got the Nightcore D11. Uh, main difference between the two lights, as you can see, is the size. The EX11 is shorter, reason being it's running on the shorter CR123A battery, and the D11 runs on the AA battery. The output is different on these two lights too. The D11 here, which is the bigger one, has got a, a lower output of 145 lumens. Still very, very bright for something this small at everyday carry. The Nikkor EX11, running on the higher voltage lithium battery, is outputting 200 lumens. This is an extremely bright pocket-sized flashlight. Probably one of the brightest on the market at the moment. Um, we'll go into the user interface of these lights in a minute. The EX11 can also run under rechargeable 16340 batteries. So you can also use these rechargeables. You can find these in our battery section. In the battery in the pack it comes with a Nikkor warranty card and it also comes with a full set of instructions. You get a lanyard attachment, you get a lanyard and you get a few spare O-rings in here as well. Now I'll just go into the user interface of the light. User interface is the same for both of them, so we'll use, we'll use the D11 for an example. It doesn't have a clicky at the back, it works on a pressure piston that puts pressure on the chip down at the bottom. So to turn it on, all you do is you press quickly and release, and the light's on. You press quickly and it's, it's off again. If you want to change the output of the light, for instance, we turn the light on. You, you can, you know, if this is too high or too low, it's easy to adjust it. All you do is you keep your finger on the switch at the back, like this. And as you can see, it's starting to ramp down. When you get the setting you want, you just take your finger off and it sets it. You can switch it off. When you switch the light back on, it will come on at the setting that you set it at. And if you want to put it back up again, you just simply do the same process again. You keep your finger on it and it starts to ramp up. When you get to a setting you like, take your finger off and it's set. It's as easy as that. Um, it's also got a couple of hidden modes. It's got a strobe and it's got SOS built into it. Um, to activate these you simply double tap on the back. So you go and you can activate the strobe. So that's quite useful. And you do that a second time and it will go into an SOS mode. As I said, the EX11 works the same way. The user interface on both of these lights are identical. So that is the Nightcore EX11 and the Nightcore D11. I'll just give you a closer look at the finish on the actual light. As you can see, they're very well finished, very well machined. This one's the same. Switches are the same. the Nikkor EX11 and the Nikkor D11.